Hi, it's Agnes Vivarelli and today I'm going to read you something fantastic about interpretation. Now this comes from Paul Etano. He is a Facebook friend of mine and this is one of the best things I've ever heard. So I asked him if I could use it in a YouTube and he has agreed. So and just bear with me because it's on my little phone and uh, I've got to stretch it because it um, it just it's hard to read. So just know this, neither situations, conditions or people make you feel one way or another. Very few things outside of you ever make you feel one way or another. When you feel something about a situation or a person, oh, it is because of what you thought about the person or situation. Feelings aren't out there in stuff or even in what others say or do or don't say or do. We feel however we feel due to how we think about whatever occurs or what someone says or does. With regards to how we feel, we are the ones who make ourselves feel how we feel by how we think about things. Okay. Now with this YouTube, you might need to rewind and re-listen because there's a lot of good nuggets in here. If you don't like how you've been feeling ever, if you don't like how you've been feeling, even if it's how you've been feeling about yourself, you can change it. Just change how you are thinking about the thing. I learned this in my mid-twenties and I'm 66 now and it has completely turned my life around for the better. I use this fact every day of my life and it continues to make the biggest difference in all these years since then. Oh, You have the power to determine how you feel regardless of your conditions or what other people say or do. Most people don't know this and so they suffer under the delusion that how they feel is out of their control. You don't have to be one of these people. You can learn to use your thoughts to feel how you want to feel. We create our own heaven or our own hell. Your thoughts can imprison you or set you free complications conditions or people do not upset you but the way you think about them causes your upset freedom is not possible until we discipline and retrain our minds so that last bit is page 124 of choose to live peacefully by susan smith jones phd if you say, I just can't help the way I feel, you will only make yourself a victim of your misery and you will be fooling yourself because you can change the way you feel. If you want to feel better, you must realize that your thoughts and your attitudes, not the external events, create your feelings. You can learn to change the way you think, feel and behave in the here and now and that comes from feeling good handbook by David Burns so we've read that read that a little bit more if you let the world affect how you feel what you are saying is I do not make my own decisions I just have a pal Pavlovian response Pavlovian was the dog for those of you that want to look up Pavlov um, have a Pavlovian response to anything that may have that may twang my emotions that was written by Stuart Wilde in life was never meant to be a struggle last couple of paragraphs I can't emphasize this strongly enough if you haven't been able to feel how you want to feel and haven't been able to get yourself to do something you want to do then you are being victimized by your own disempowering thoughts, beliefs and attitudes. And that's by Mike Brescher, President, Think Right Now International. 
oh, everything in your life can be taken away except for this one thing. Your freedom to how you respond to a situation. Dr. Viktor Frankl in Man's Search for Meaning. So if you're in the middle of something right now and you feel like not very good about it, remember that you are able to feel differently. You are not at the mercy of feeling the way you do. It is your thoughts and what you feel that has created the state that you're in. So yeah, this, this reading has really, really got a lot of nuggets in it. So if you go back, if you're feeling disempowered or affected by someone, um, go back and read it and, or listen to it and see if you can work out what it is you can do to ease the feeling you got going on and to change it into something much more empowering through changing your self-talk. So that's it for today. I've wanted to read that to you for a long time, but Paul, or not Paul, Phil, Atano hadn't responded about allowing me to use it, so I had to wait. So there you go. Lots of love to you, and I hope you enjoy it, and you use it, and you use it, and you use it, and you make yourself feel better despite whatever is going on. Lots of love to you.